Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Look what we got out here today, Max. We got Randy out here. Randy said he wanted to come out here and get some exercise with me. So what we're gonna do, we, I've changed my mind on this build. I was gonna try to do it all with the auger, but as you've probably already seen, I went and rented this bad boy. So I think Randy said he wanted to try out the little auger, right? Why run this one? Yes. <laughs> so we, we need, I need to get this, this pin done and we're hoping we can get it done together today as far as getting the holes dug with this machine and getting the post set. I got a bunch of concrete back there. But the only thing I think we're gonna run into is all this wetness. I do not wanna get this thing stuck because we don't have a tractor out here. I do have a chain, so we could hook it up to the, the truck and pull out if we need to, but it's on track, so that's a plus. Um, and we got about 30 more posts to set. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna see how far we can get with this thing. I got it for the day and uh we're gonna we're gonna try to knock it out so if you guys enjoyed today's video if you do smash that like button if you're not subscribed yet please subscribe to the channel and uh, watch us work today i hope you guys enjoy watching us work as much as i like other people working when i watch them so all right let's check this little machine out real quick so that looks like a 10 inch auger like the one i got this actually comes with a bunch of different attachments we're not gonna need that there is a drag bar and there's some forks over there um, but mainly we're just gonna be using this auger right now and uh, once we get all the holes dug, I could put the I could put um, the forks on, and we can stack some of those uh, um, posts on there, and then put them to each hole. So what we're going to do first is we're going to I'm going to get the line set up. I'll get this in there, get the line set up, and get each of them marked, and we're just going to start drilling holes. You know, then we'll come back and see what we need to do. We might go ahead and hit these other ones too, get a little bit deeper on the ones I did yesterday and day before. So let's get busy. Okay, that took all of 30 seconds, I think. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so hopefully they all go just like that one. I don't think it go any better. It's solid clay right here. I don't even know if we even pulled any rocks up in this hole. That was crazy. I don't think there was. There was one, was there? So that's actually about 30 to 32 inches and if we can do that in the rest of the holes that's what we're going to do and uh, we'll wait and see how all this goes and uh, we'll come back if we have time or whatever and, and get these deeper too um, so i'm just going to set this up on kind of like a time lapse and we're just going to go straight through here and see what we can get done we got to set up the string and all that and mark it and we'll get busy
Okay, we got all the holes dug. Now we're gonna start setting post. Um, I got 20 bags. I got about a thousand pounds of concrete. So we'll see how many, how far that goes. I don't think these smaller holes will take the whole bag at my, my, but these bigger holes that we just drilled are gonna take at least two bags per. Randy's. There's a bug. Randy's, get, Randy's driving the tractor over here. We're going to try to see if we can't get in here with that. So we're uh, saving our back a little bit.
it's down this way or is it that fine? That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, several of you guys asked, how come you ain't putting water in there? Because there's already water in there. Look at that. Got on the button there. That one don't have none in it, but this one does. Look. So yeah, you see, you'll see us just dumping the bags in there because there's already water down the bottom. Even at the farm uh, land, we don't mix water in there because all the moisture out of the ground will suck into there, so you really don't have to mix it. So that's actually, stays as, saves us a step. Um, so what we're doing right now, we're gonna do this one. We're gonna work on this one long section. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough uh, cement bags, um, but if not, I'll just get some more. Crazy. I think it's filling up as quick as I'm getting. It <laughs> ain't going down very fast, no. is it? Need a sump pump. Broke my cup. Oh, I got it. Oh. Half the size. Okay, so you want to raise pigs and you want to build your own pig pen. Let me show you what we're dealing with right here. Check this out. Yeah, man. We got we had to move the post over because it felt like a little rock in here. So I've been digging around and I found a nugget of gold. <laughs> That's that was inside our our hole.
Not all about that. So did I. Have you got the keeper for this? Oh. Yeah. There you go. Man. That'll help. Yeah, that'll help a lot. Easy. Oh. Max, did you have fun today? Is that a yes? Smile if you had fun. <laughs> Randy, are you gonna get on that little auger for a minute or what? No. <laughs> sit. Hey, Max, can you sit? Can you sit? Sit. He needs a piece okay. of jerky. Oh, look at that. Can you lay down? Hey, hey, sit. Lay down. <laughs> lay down. He said, I'm lay going down. to as soon as lay I get down. home. Lay down. Lay down. There he goes. Lay down. Hey, lay down. Here, I'll shake your hand. Okay, lay down. He's been bragging on them all day about how he can lay down on command and he got camera shy, I think. Lay down. He ain't gonna do lay it. Down. Now. Let me walk over here and I'll show you guys what we got done today. We got every single hole drilled and i know i probably should got that on the first day but you know what i wanted to make a video showing you guys you don't have to have a pickup truck and a trailer and all that you can literally order that from amazon and go out in your front yard backyard whatever and start digging but then i wanted to make another video get with this piece of equipment showing you the easy way to do it i want to do the hard way first and then the easy way yeah right huh <laughs> check this out i probably should pull the drone out when we get done so you could really see good but look at that we got the whole front done, um, set in place. We used, we have a thousand pounds, a half a ton of concrete in all these posts. Is that a lot? It sounds like a lot. I think, it, I think it's a thousand, I think it was a thousand pounds, 50, 20, 50 pound bags. That's a lot. So we ran out of, we ran out of the bags and uh, we'll pick all this mess up later when we get done. Um, but, so we got all these set and now we got to do the rest, but I have to go get some more concrete. So yeah, it was a lot easier with Randy's help today and uh, Max's help, he was supervising. And with this, um, it's not really a ditch witch, I don't know what it is, it has a bunch of different attachments on it. Um, but for the price, it was like 150 bucks and I got it all done. We got, we got them dug pretty quick. Probably the way we should have done it the first, but I wanted to do it with, my, with that auger. I, didn't, I guess I didn't realize just how rocky it really was out here until we, I started digging. You know, but this stuff, this thing right here made it, it made it super simple and easy. So I'm glad I went and got it today. I was actually going over to get some bags of concrete and I seen that sitting in the parking lot and I said, how much is that? 150 bucks for all day. It was, it was a good deal. Um, but that's all I got for you guys today. Um, I probably won't show any more of putting the post in and all that. Probably the next time I make a video on this project is when I'm putting the fence up, the actual fence. Um, because you've guys, I've made about three videos digging holes and putting posts in. And I think it's probably enough. It's probably enough. So with that being said, thank you so much. If you made this far, like I say all the time, you guys love us. You love the content we're putting out. You love my family. You love the channel. And uh, we appreciate each and every one of you guys. So that, if you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe. And uh, smash that like button. Hadley says, turn that notification bell on. So if you guys do all that, we greatly appreciate it. And I uh, love you guys. We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.